Hello everybody! Well, uh, Kodak has the one here. MJ 406 Inside Koshi here. And uh, welcome to a uh, Halloween Fest project. Um, God, first time in how many years? It's been 84 years! <laughs> and we say it's a Halloween project, what's we get here? Knowing our lucky probably won't know air until Christmas. <laughs> like a nightmare before Christmas. Ayo! Anyway. <laughs> oh my. Alright, so. Yes, we have the Castle Anniversary Collection here! Oh, we can do the Game Boy one! Don't do it! Those ones stick. Well, at least the first one's the first bad. The one's bad. second one's okay. Yeah. Blow Lines is also there. I'd recommend not playing this version, though. But yes! Okay. We have the first official release of this game here internationally! Uh, Kid Dracula, yep. <laughs> yep. The plot's pretty simple for this. It's basically just... Yeah, Kid Dracula was asleep for a long time, and somebody tried to take over being the new... Demon Lord or whatever the fuck. So he woke up and is trying to get revenge. That's basically what's happening here. Somebody, that guy. Somebody screwed up the moon. Fuck you, moon! Ow! Majora's mask being this weird. <laughs> It'd be really nice if it ended that quickly. <laughs> <laughs> just throw a rock at it. No, it's just Dracula comes in and tells us. Well, that was a start key. I don't start button. So, yep. Yeah. This game is actually unlike most other Castlevania games, so it stars Dracula, oddly enough. Yep. As soon as he wakes the fuck up, which he will. There you, know, you go. You man. know what the green coloring I'm mentioning Mario waking up from there? <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! What the fuck am I in Transylvania? What the hell's all these brawls and fucking Frankenstein monsters? Alright, so I'm just getting. It's better than this NES game, so we just got. The control stick, or the D-pad, A, B, and select as well, which that won't really become apparent until after this stage. Alright. Yeah, I want to say this game's kind of like a Mega Man game, kind of. I'm imagining spikes uh, are instant death. No. There's nothing in this game that's instant death except for falling into a pit. Which, by the way, you can hold B to charge your attacks. Okay. And you kill an enemy using a charge attack, which I think you can shoot upward as well. You get a coin! Money! You have to go with a charge attack particular. If you just go with a regular attack, you typically don't get a coin. I still got money for that, though. You said typically, so... Yeah. You are guaranteed a coin drop if you kill a charge attack. Okay. I'm guessing the money is used for buying power-ups in a store. You'll see. You'll see once you get to the end of the stage. Oh, lovely. Also, be sure to pick up those hearts! Yeah, because I imagine that's a... Yep. White <clears throat> Priest! Yay! There's one of those in every stage. Except for, I think, the very last one. Then again, they're not nearly as generous as you would like to think they are. So it's basically like, uh, heart containers. Yeah. Seems like your rate of fire isn't particularly great early on. You can, you can fire rapidly, it's just, you know, again, your guaranteed coins are going with charge shot. You can still do little pee shots and just kill them that way if you wish. Okay, I don't- I know this is- this is supposed to be Transylvania, what the heck is all of your <laughs> Japanese demons doing here? Yeah, I got- Oh, they're Chinese about. zombies, yeah. Oh, yeah, the Chinese zombies. Either way. Okay. It's Transylvania, we're, we're not supposed to be Japan or China! Aren't we supposed to be, like, Europe? Yeah, <clears throat> somewhere in Europe. We're not, not supposed fun. to be in the Jap- Japan area until Ar Arya Sonora. Right. Yeah. Speaking of which, I finally got that Dominus collection on my mm, PC. Nice. Oh, yeah. I've heard those games are hard. But good. I played Portrait of Ruin in the past. I have not played a Order of Ecclesia. yet. I've heard Dawn of Sorrow isn't particularly... It, I was... Oh yeah, I think I heard Dawn of Sorrow. Okay, so there is a delay on switching directions, I've noticed. Oh. Yeah, probably have to watch this through <clears throat> rate, yeah. You can't absolutely rapid fire, but you know. Yeah. You don't well, have to go I'm right. saying with the charge shot, because I know when I, I did hit forward, yeah. forward, because you saw I was moving, but it still shot upwards. He was still in the middle of basically finishing his shot that was upward, right? Yeah. You, can, you can't fire the ladder, can you? I don't know if I can. Okay, so I can. Can you fire upward from the ladder, I wonder? Mm, I'd assume I would no. assume no. Okay, you're going yeah. inside. Alright, I'm just curious. I didn't remember. Yeah, because as soon as I hit hold uh, touch up, like it goes up on the ladder, so. Right, 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 right. I didn't know if you could like try to let go be while you're climbing up or anything. That was the only thing I was thinking. This does feel like a somewhat loose interpretation of some of the stages from Castlevania 1, I realized. Yeah. Sort of. 
At least this part feels like a little bit like the first stage in the first game. If it was supposed to be accurate, he'd be walking down the stairs from his freaking um, throne room. <laughs> yeah. Also true. Yeah, don't worry about grinding coins. They're not that important. They're, they can yeah. be helpful. But, you know, if you just want to kill enemies, it's not the worst idea. Yeah, don't just just, uh, just get going and clear The game will get a little easier as we go on. <sighs> well, you'll get more powerful as the game goes Oh, on. That, that was funny, though. Like, you saw that, right, with the Chinese zombie? Like, yeah. he was right underneath and he was like, eh, 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 eh. <laughs> yeah. Smarter than any other game, so you know, get used to some of the jankiness, although. Oh, hi, Clock Tower. It really just does feel like a cartoony Castlevania game. <clears throat> it kinda does, but, you know, it works. Mm hmm. Oh, an enemy respawning is still a thing. Oh, that's fun. Yep. Gee, it's almost like it's an NES game. Off screen, I'm enough. Yep. It's, yep. Like yep. it's like Kirby and Mega Man rules, yeah. Yep. Like I said, to me, this feels kind of like a Mega Man esque game. It's a lot more of a run and gun platformer than a freaking. You so know. I'll definitely get the coins that like do, doing the charge shot thing if like yeah. uh, if like there's barely any enemies on yeah. the screen just to kind of yep, get that. Yep, be smart, there. protect yourself. Yep. Yep. Now I'm trying to think. If you hit ZL, I think you can do save states if you want. Okay. Oh, yeah, the, um, that is an option in the collection. I'm okay. assuming jumping on those things is probably. Yeah, don't jump on them. If you know how they work, Castlevania Three, you know how they work. Yep, there. like so. I think this game came out in 1989, so I'm pretty sure this came out a bit after Castlevania Three. Bitch. It'll knock back. How oh, I fucking hate you. Yeah, there is no knockback, you know. Does play by some Castlevania rules. Just, you know, be Bitch. careful. There are checkpoints in these stages. I think it's only like. There's okay. like one major checkpoint. Well, well, we'll find out. Okay, so yep. this is the checkpoint. So yep. we'll go ahead and. Um... You can just go over there to save. Yep. <clears throat> Yeah, I don't know what other save data I had in there, but it doesn't really matter. Oh, you even got the the stopwatch as uh, their icon. Well, that, that's cool. Yeah, there was a nice touch to this. Is, unfortunately, this is probably one of the least polished of the uh, big collections that Konami has for their games. Most of the games work fine on here. I just know two in particular are a little rough. Oh, okay, I see the different coloration. Yep. Yep, good read, good read. But yeah, I know two games in this collection are particularly rough. One of them being the okay, first Okay, so that's just a heal. Because one of them's the first Castlevania game. Oh, here we are at the stairs. Oh, so we're at the end of the game, right, guys? I mean, of course. It's a really short game. It's, it's only Castlevania for kids. Oh, God, who clocks play? I mean, Ghost. Yeah, it's just, I don't want to be scared of Ghost. <laughs> hey, look, it's the white trash. No, Booby, Booby! Who do you call white trash? Oh, God! Oh, the guy even bigger. Great. Don't you know that's always the rule? Yep. Yeah, by the way, you can crouch, so be sure to keep that in mind, too. And what well, wasn't obvious, if you, if you lose all your lives on a stage, you have to do the whole stage over. Ooh, got him right before he got you! Damn! Nice. There you go, that's the other first stage. Master of Close Calls, indeed. Yes, yeah, homing spell! Now you press select. In stages, you can now Ooh. change your charge shots. Ooh, that's a spread shot. I love it. That's probably the best one. I'm in the Kooji! I'm in the Kooji! These are where we were used before, by the way! Which will be! Basically, select the path and, well, you'll go to whatever minigame it is. I'm trying to remember which one's good. Hmm. Okay. You'll land in B, I think. I'll, yeah, I would land in B if I'm go here. If I go here, it'll be D. Okay, yeah. Um, yeah, let, let's. Give that a try. Maybe you try all of them at least once, of course. Or they added one, you Yeah, they also say. added paths afterwards. They're dicks like that. Dick! That's yep. dickish. You got roulette! I'm oh, sorry, you wanna, did you wanna play Can Can? Go fuck yourself. Have fun! Get fucked. You always just reload if you want to try. So basically, all the coins you yeah, have. Yeah, but then I have to do the boss again. Basically, all the coins you have. I mean, you, you can save and also load. That is also After true. a stage, we can do that next time. Yep, basically, you can uh, put in coins to try and basically get more lives. Alright, let's try that, 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 that. Yep, you put in one metal per all those you're trying to go for. Okay. So if it lands on one of those symbols, you'll get that many lives. Ooh. Hopefully you don't land on zero. And you get... You get three lives! Three lives. Woo! See you again! Yep. Go 
Look, that's what your medals are useful for. So hit select. Okay. There's no minus, yep. Now when you do a charge shot, now when you release it becomes a homing shot. Nice. Yeah, so it's definitely good to experiment with a lot of the uh, extra shots you get. Basically get one of those after every stage for a while. Those are the main upgrades you get. I'm not saying, like, you call it a homing shot, I'm like, it looks more like a, it's just purely a sprint shot. Oh, oh, no, it doesn't, actually. Yeah, it's using a lot of... Did that witch just try to crap an egg on you? Yep. Yeah, I was gonna say, like... Um, I heard... I know the egg jokes, but... <laughs> it's a little obsessive, wouldn't you say? Oh, damn it. Yeah, we're platforming. Yeah, yep. that... Yeah, like I said, Follies, you're always to death. At least I think. I think crushing might also be oh, to shit. death, but I don't think you have to worry about that. I, I just want back to... Yeah, uh, just make sure you keep an eye on that. You can always see what shot you're on in the, uh, the bottom of the screen and around the left corner. Okay. Also, also interesting, they basically show his face. He's basically... They let you know he has a charge shot ready, too. Just for his face. He just gets aggressively angry. Okay. It's like, bleh. So the flashing indicator isn't enough for you, you got that. Yeah. But yep, you know, platform shenanigans, shoot enemies out of your way, just, you know. Oh! Okay. I wasn't expecting that. It's a much more lighthearted platform compared to other Castlevania games. Alright. Ooh, another life expansion. Oh, you have to get there from below, from above. Yep. Whoa, that slowed down. I mean, yeah. What do you expect from an NES game? Now, it's a nice reminder. Ah. You know, oh, Konami's been giving a lot of cap right, love to a lot of the old Castlevania games again. Yeah. What do you think we're gonna try to get somebody to make another one? On the 12th of Never. Probably. Considering all the backlash they basically, the um, thousand cousins they basically gave themselves, yeah, I'm not expecting much. That is true. Also, that's kind of take your placement where it's like, yes, thanks for. I think that they might can just fall to the right side. Yeah. Ah. Be safe. Yep. Also, another thing to mention, because unlike a lot of other Castlevania games, you don't have a time limit, which is nice. No time limit. Um, the the screen doesn't lock below you if you go too high. You can actually control your jump in midair. Yeah. This, this is definitely a much. Nice. Looks like you can. This is definitely a much friendlier Castlevania game than most of them tend to be. Ah. Okay. Yeah, you really gotta time your jump well for this. Yeah. Or just try to sneak it when it. There you go. Use the slowdown to my advantage. Of course. I the gave the advantage. Actually having controllable jump. Nice. 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 Okay. Yeah, again, it's been a good while since Konami's released any game really worthwhile. Uh, like anything original. Like, jeez, what's the last time they released oh, a okay. worthwhile game? So Hell here, is solid. This is five. a good thing. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that was a joke. That, but honestly, that might be it. Wow. They had a lot of other games. Oh, that's been classic collections. Ah, whoa! Yeah, careful. Gotta, gotta kill them or jump over them. God damn it, Zeus! Not now. Baby Zeus. Even weirder. Ew. Careful, those will blow wind to try to blow you off. Oh, I see it. Now, you can only have five bullets on screen at a time from your homing shot. Alright, well, I got, got the one guy. Ooh! You ran back on. Smart maneuver. Ooh, nice. See, doesn't this feel like the vehicle stages from Mega Man? Yeah, I can kind of say it. Okay. It's like everybody's favorite stage from Mega Man 5. Yeah. <laughs> or Mega Man 8. Oh, God. Or Mega Man X8. Uh, yeah. <laughs> or X7. Oh, dear. Oh yeah, That's we, oh yeah, we still have to get to that game. Oh god! That's why I'm playing Mega Man 11 first. I'm gonna delay that game as long as I fucking can. All right. And then we have the Game Boy ones. And you really want to extend it more? We got Wily Wars. Say as a joke, but I honestly might consider doing that. Yeah. I, I figured that was gonna be. Honestly, I kind of thought that was gonna Damn be it. your. Oh, I forgot my charge on. Why would you do a save state? Just be safe. Here. I, yeah, I, I'm about to say. I did a save state. Oh, you did. Right, right before. Oh, okay. Um, All right, you beat me to it. I wasn't paying attention. The only safe thing I saw was... Like, I was about to say, like, did you load the safe thing in the first level? God, ah. Oh, yeah, so you can see what direction the clouds are moving, you see where their eyes are pointing. Yeah. Yep, I, I did figure that out. Man, stop dropping your frickin' jewels on me! 
What is it with, with witches and crystal balls? Ow! Oh, never mind. You do not take damage. Here comes the next boss! The giant chicken! Uh, this is explained to the eggs. With the homing shot, things are much easier. Mm-hmm. Hey, this is primarily the shot you're probably gonna use most of the rest of the game. Yeah, honestly. pretty much. There might be exceptions for certain things. I know there will be late game. Cause I'll say this, I think there are bosses later on that can only get hit by certain kinds of, uh, charge shots. Uh, okay. There we go! Boss is Fried chicken! Alright, you wanna try to get to the other minigames? You may wanna do a save state now. Although, you got bombs! Woo! So, yep! Now you do explosive shots! They linger! That can be useful against bosses. At least if you don't right. need to home in on them. Do I make a safe state because they're probably gonna fuck you over? <laughs> yep. As long as you get something different from roulette, it should be fine. Yeah, well, just in case. You uh, honestly, just say, first, right? you honestly, just hit A and say, fuck it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they did add a couple this time. Uh-huh. Yeah. We got C! We got Garapon! Now we got Garapon. Let's go for a spin! Ah, uh, okay, this is probably the best one. It's pure luck. Basically, for every three coins you have, you get to spin the wheel. Oh, it reminds me of that, um... Uh, what was it? The... That thing, um... In Mario Party 4. You yeah. Know what about. Hey, five coins, spin the wheel! Hope you get a lucky ball! Yep. That's a lottery, got it. You got six tries! I think you just have to move the D-pad or something? Um... Either move the D-pad or press the... Oh, uh, I have to rotate it. That's what it is. Woo! You got three lives your first try! Now you got... Nothing! Of course, oh, no. the white one that does mean. Oh no! Oh no, oh no. The Japanese love these kind of games. Oh, what yeah. a... Yeah. Yeah. Still, Still better. Still better than, yeah. Oh no. And the last one you get is... Red! You got five lives? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, see, this game's nice and generous at this. See you again. Good luck. Yeah, fuck. Go fuck. So, yeah, may as well save. Just Might let as me well. keep our lives intact. Yep. So now you got Bomb Shot. Alright, so let's, let's at least show it off. I guess, uh... Um, yeah. You said it'd probably be better for bosses. Yeah, probably, but, you know, it's a good explosive shot. Against stronger foes, this is pretty good. You know, I would probably stick to holding shots otherwise, but... Yeah, normal just gives you a big, wide shot. Yeah. Okay, so those... Oh, yay, fire underwater. Oh, yeah, basically Mario how long logic. you hold the jump button indicates how high you jump, so, you know. Okay. Hello, hotheads. Be careful with that. And yep, when you hit them, whatever direction the spikes are pointing, that's where they explode. Yeah, I figured that out after I got hit by the first one. Yep. They're an annoying enemy. Yeah, yep. but oh, I don't know it's not too bad, honestly. Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh, these kind of platforming yep. things. Ooh, life Whoa. expansion! Oh, that'd be nice! Oh, I'd love to have more than five hearts. Oh, shit. Shit, no! About that. Your max life is only five hearts. Well, it's a good full heal, I guess. Yeah. Hey, hey, oh, you motherfucker. I love this gimmick for Mega Man 5. <laughs> and right on top of a heart, too. Of course. But yeah, I wonder if they're gonna release another good Castlevania game again. Like, think about it, the last Castlevania game we had was freaking Mirrors of Fate. Ah. That was probably like, what, 2014, 2015? Roughly. Like, it's been nearly 10 years without a new Castlevania game. It's crazy. Honestly, though, considering how technically there was a new Castlevania game, it wasn't a good one, it was new. And of course, the fucking Gacha game, though. Oh, right. I yeah. guess there was that, I forgot about it. It's kind of really hard to count Gacha games. That's really like counting Pokemon Masters as a Pokemon game. Or any mobile game, for that matter. Yeah, that yeah basically. At least Fire Emblem Heroes is somewhat respectable to the source material. It's still fully playable for free and feels like Fire Emblem. It's Although they have a season pass now. That's more if you're trying to get extra benefits as well as unique character skins, which, honestly, you're stupid if you go for that. Yeah, right. Then again, that's the thing about mobile games. It, does, it doesn't go uh, to please the um, hardcore game or please just the hardcore game work. Damn it. Yeah. That, that was just me mistiming it. Okay. That is true. Well, speaking of Nintendo Mobile news, I know they're apparently getting ready to shut down the uh, free-to-play uh, Animal Crossing app they Yeah. Had. Now they're gonna release a paid version instead. Which... 
Hon honestly, I saw it coming a oh. mile away. And yeah, it was no, nope, didn't didn't happen. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. It, it's just it's getting rid of the uh, free to play stuff in it and the subscription service they have for that too. Which honestly is probably better for them to do it that way. But yep. now they just have, have a committed mobile thing that's just basically you can pay to play if you want, and it's a one-time thing. Yeah, which is what, um, uh, what's it called? Um, Mario Run? Yeah, that's the way they did it, which honestly was a good move. Uh-huh. Um, I mean, they don't really update it anymore, but you know, it, it has some nice arcade replay value if you really care for it. I mean, at the very least, I play through it once a day for the freaking platinum points. I guess this is a good spot to grind coins if you really want to. Yeah. From these freaking uh, uh, limbless humans. <laughs> well, there was. A, I'm just saying because of how quickly they respond to all that. Or socks. Yeah. <laughs> like, I got. I, 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 I feel like they're humans I, 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 wearing I, I, goggles and thongs with no legs or arms. <laughs> I guess they're right. like struggling. All right, <laughs> let's, let's let's try to move on. Yeah. He's getting a lot of coins though. I think the boss is in this. Or they're coming up, I think. If I heard this boss is a somewhat pain in the ass. Yep, boss is right here. All right, hang on. Wait. You wanna save? I did try to save, but I think I saved the replay instead. Oh. Eh, it doesn't do anything major. That's it, the replay if you get, I'll just stay in there and let your stupid Yep, yeah, that thing is just bounce around a bubble, just try not to get by the bubble, otherwise just, you know, yep, fire shots at it. Hopefully it doesn't keep wandering off screen like it keeps doing. Yeah, this boss just feels more tedious than anything else. Yeah, yeah so pumping shot the, is the way to go. Yeah. If you lock a bomb shot, it's nice, but with how much it bounces, it's not really worth the effort. Yeah. Just grind it out and make sure you aren't caught where the bubble's gonna bounce. Yeah, it looks like it's horizontal speed moves as you do damage to it. So, you know, just be careful, make sure it's not gonna be on the ground when you are. Mm hmm. And don't forget, you can still jump the entire of the screen, so if you wanna gamble jumping over it, that's on you. <laughs> Which honestly is an incredibly stupid idea. It's not like the screen moves with you. Yeah. Yep. I was saying, I'm glad you remembered you could duck. Oh, they fucked you there. Yeah, they kind of did. Stop bouncing away from my shots! Why does a squid need to be in a bubble anyway? Because it's special. I was saying, don't they breathe water? And it's dead. We killed Squidward. We put him in his misery. <laughs> Hey, Squidward! Hey, Squidward! I'm so now, you, now you have the ability to transform to a bat! Woo! And notice you have a time limit there on the bottom screen. Okay. So you have something to keep in mind, you'll need that for platforming later. So we did A and C, so the only ones we see now are B and D. Are B and D. So, let's go ahead and yes, I think C is my favorite one. I think D is my least favorite one. Alright, so let's do the A portion, see where that gets us. A, you got A. A, we got roulette again. No, I don't want reward! Nope, not, nope, didn't happen. That is some bullshit, though, that they just randomly decide to add shit. Yeah, like, hey, in case you know how to read it, they're like, fuck you. Well, we got D, so now we got Job and Pump. Woo! I think it's my least favorite one. Another one that's lock based. Stab me, stab me, scratch that. That itch for me. Ew. <laughs> they basically gotta hit certain ones and avoid certain ones, I think. Okay. So that's all luck. You know, we have plenty of lives, so it is what it is. Yep, you hit that, you lose. Oh. It's all random. That's why I hate that one. Okay. 